END here. One of the best performing decks in standard is without any doubt Boros Convoke. Boros Convoke is the essence of what I believe magic should be. Build a big army and swing for victory. <laughs> Opening hand, that's okay. Already played a warden of the inner sky. Let's see our opponent what they are playing. Blue white control. I really hate this deck, blue white control. Really hate that deck. Really hate it. It goes against my deck. I like to build a big army and swing for victory. Blue white control really limits my army. War leader's call. One of the best enchantments from Merdus at Call of Manor. Very strong card. Very, very strong card. There's Rafine. Okay. Danik is swinging. Danik has lifelink. Probably. Okay, I'm not going to block. I'm not going to waste my warden. Okay, I have an Aganjo. A resolute reinforcement. A sanguine evangelist. Knight of the Errant Eos. And the case of the Gateway Express. For the time being, I'm not going to play that card for sure. Let's go with the Resolute. Like this, I have three creatures. Let's convoke. We need to build our army. And War Leader's Call is doing their job. Pinging my opponent. They are at 19. Okay, Danik doesn't have flying. Rafin, yes. I think my opponent is going to swing with everything. Pumping Danik so that they will gain some life. Shouldered, okay, shouldered. <laughs> shouldered the apocalypse. One of the best creatures currently in standard. Told you they are pumping Danik. At this stage, I don't need to block. I'm not going to block. Yes, I'm at 10. They are at 28. Let's start playing. Let's start playing our game. Novice Inspector. Think my opponent. The reinforcements. More pinging my opponent. At this stage, I think the most dangerous creature is not Shouldered. Yes, it's Shouldered. Let's remove Shouldered. Let's remove Shouldered. Let's swing. Danik has lifelink. Danik has lifelink. Let's swing with everything. No. Three were enough so that I can resolve the case of the Gateway Express. My creatures are all pumped up yes my opponent will swing but they will be open i will just block the neck okay they swing they swing they swing for life okay then it doesn't have temple so i can just sacrifice one of my creatures or do nothing Sacrifice one of my creatures or nothing. They're going to... At 6 life. I will be at 2. No block. Or we just block... No, no block. Let's see. My opponent. Nothing. My opponent does nothing. Do they have some sort of a board wipe? If they don't have a board wipe, the game is over. Do they have a board wipe? Another land, Sunfall, a Platzot, okay, another creature with lifelink. Now I have to go for victory, because, yes, I have to go for victory. I'm going for victory, a Platzot will block. I need to do as much damage as possible, yes, they are at zero, but they are four. Now, put the Sanguine. Sanguine will create a bet. There too. I just pop that clue and the game is over. 
GG, good game, my friend. Good game, my friend. <laughs> good game. Very, very good game. Extremely good game. Build your army and swing for victory. Let's play another game. Drood v Max. Okay, opening hand. Could have been better. Another land. But this deck with two lands you can play. Let's start. With a planes, yes. Let's start with a planes, planes and the water. We got that Mirix, the third land, which is enough. There is a spyglass siren. Okay, they popped the map. Network disrupted. Okay, another land. Let's put the mountain and let's cast the resolute. The only reason why I cast the resolute now, only because I wanted to use the ability of the warden. For the time being, I have three creatures and two lands. Next turn, I can put another land, and if my creatures are still alive, I can convoke the knight. There's the synthesizer. <laughs> the synthesizer. How strong that card is. Release price was around 15 to 18 dollars. Now it's around 35, 40 dollars. <laughs> 35 40 dollars for a card. <laughs> Let's put the Evangelist. I have five creatures and I can convoke my knight. Let's convoke. Fully convoke. There's another knight and there is a Emodine recruiter. Another synthesizer. Okay. Synthesizer will create a golem, an art of a golem. Okay, they are scrying too. Honestly, I think I can put the Mirex. I can put the Mirex. I can destroy that golem. Let's remove the golem for the time being. I could have swing with my Emodine Recruiter. Yes, I could have swing with my Emodine Recruiter. At this stage, I can try and attack with three creatures the only reason why atta I attacked with three creatures is to resolve the case of the gateway express which will pump will further pump my creatures they didn't even block shall I demolish one of his or their synthesizer no let's put another knight let's put another knight let's convoke there is a novice inspector and there is another warden. Good. Good, good, good. My creatures are, are pumped. Next turn I can go novice inspector and recruiter. Or I can go novice inspector, warden, demolish and convoke again the knight. Ninjutsu. Ninjutsu. Okay. Okay, now they are increasing their board they are at 10 I am at 18 okay nothing happens can I win I think I can win I can put an inspector they have four blockers they have four blockers let's put the recruiter and let's swing for victory let's swing for victory the Evangelist will further pump my creatures with their battle cry. Four blockers, they are blocking, let's say, the biggest creatures, but I don't think that's enough. They know they need to block more than four creatures and the game. The game is over minus 11, 18. <laughs> minus 11, 18. If I had a land, I could demolish that clue and swing for more and more life points okay why not let's play another game my opponent conrad okay very simple conrad opening hand mm, not one of the best but still two lands it's enough for this deck let's go planes and warden hopefully we get a red source a mountain mirax will give me a red source but only when i put it in play 
Okay, at this stage I can go Mirex, I can go the Epicure. I can put another Warden. I can use the ability of the first Warden. Let's cry. Hopefully we have a red source. Not no red source. Okay, we need a land. We need a land at this stage. We need a land. Blue white. Blue white control. Okay, this is a very, very annoying deck. No red source. No red land. Let's <laughs> that's the only option we have. Let's cry. Trying to get a land. No land and really and truly I don't need that epicure. I have a resolute reinforcement which I would play I will play at the end of my opponent's turn. What they are going to do? Get lost, get lost or or bounce, no march of the outer worldly light, okay. I can do nothing. My warden is gone. I will play the reinforcements at the end of my opponent's turn. Let's pass, let's pass my turn, put it there. They cannot board wipe. Usually board wipes are no more lives, okay. No more lives, but and that's a land, not really the land that I needed. I needed a really a red source. It's a pity that I don't have a red source, a red land. No, I don't need that. I don't need that. Things are looking very bad. Things are looking very bad in this game. My opponent already has four lands. And they have the mix of the cards they want. Let's convoke. At this stage, let's convoke. Let's convoke what they are going to do. Wandering Emperor. Only an Epicure, hmm, that's bad, only an Epicure, and that's it, so, four cards in hand, all, let's say, red source, and I don't have a red card, I don't have a red land, a mountain, a dual land, nothing, let's scry the warden again, okay, a mountain, finally, a mountain, I think, let's swing, let's swing. Probably they have the Wandering Emperor, which means that the Warden or the Knight, they will be exiled. Do you have the Wandering Emperor? Four open mana, two white, get lost. Knockout blow, okay, okay. Knockout blow. The knight is gone. What they do? They have something else. Do they have something? Nothing. Nothing. Okay. They are at fifteen. My warden of the inner sky is still alive. Very good card. We know that cell mountain. At this stage, I want to cry hoping for another land let's say oh yes i want that land i can demolish the blood token what do they have in hand another counter no more lies but i can pay i can pay three mana what they're going to do don't tell me they have another the negate okay so they used Two counters for one spell. Let's swing. Let's swing. They are at seven. I'm at twenty. Okay. I think the game has been turned around. Some for unless unless I was saying unless they have a board wipe. Right? But now I can. Yes, I can go the epicure. I can put my emodine pumping up. So, my opponent is only at 1. Can we win this game with all those board wipes? Can we win this game? There's a novice inspector. I can go novice inspector and then the recruiter. 
Okay, I should have gone first with the novice inspector and then the recruiter. I think that was the best move. They will surely block one creature. I have to do only one damage. They surely block one creature. They will somehow remove one of one of the other two creatures. But do they have two removal spells at this stage? Do they have no <laughs> I don't know why you don't just concede. Why you don't just concede? You lost the game. You knew that you were going to lose the game and you don't concede. I really hate these type of players. When I playing and I know that I lost, I just concede. Why? Bluffing. I don't know. Last game. Let's play another game. Last game. Let's keep this hand. I told you. Mono red. Humano. Okay. Mono red. These are very fast games. These are very fast games. Mono red. Monored usually in four or five turns they win the game. Usually monored or you win the game in three, four, five turns or you just lose the game. Let's play the inner the warden. Let's play the warden, yes. Now what I want to do is let's use the warden's ability. Let's use the warden's ability. Probably the warden is dead. Okay, shock, okay. That was, let's say, normal. I didn't pretend nothing less. Just let's demolish my clue. Let's build our army. Let's build our battlefield. Etching of Kumano at 2 2. No land. They missed a land drop. Okay, so opening hand was only one mountain. At the stage, mm, at the stage, I don't think I will block. No, I will. I, I don't want to block. Okay, the inspector is gone. But now I can go. Mirex, I can go. The recruiter. And I can do some serious damage. They are at 11, I am at 17. And remember, this is a mono red deck, which is usually they do more damage than I do. I have the knight. Okay, the show off. Okay, that's a very, very strong card. Very, very strong card. Now I can go. I can go again, recruiter. I can convoke, or I can try to trick my opponent and then killing them with killing one of their creatures with the aganjo. Okay, let's play the aganjo as a land. Let's put the knight. And let's convoke. Let's convoke with four. Uh, I'm going to risk this game. I'm at 17. It's very difficult for my opponent. Not impossible, but it will be very difficult for my opponent to win this game in next turn. First of all, I have three creatures that I can defend. The Kumano. They show off. I can't block it because I don't have a flying. Another land. There's a code breaker. Okay. I think they have haste. Are they going to swing? Are they going to swing? I will win. If they swing with everything, I will win in next turn. No. No. Okay. Epicure. Epicure in play. I want to further improve my battlefield another inspector next turn i can just go with the recruiter and probably win the game probably if i have played this turn a little bit more wisely i could have easily win i could have easily won during this turn. Are they going to block the knight? Are they going to block the knight? Because I could have played the inspector instead instead of the epicure and then go with the recruiter. They are at 5, I'm at 17. Very difficult that my opponent can. Good game. 
Okay, they are saying good game. Why? They have three lands. And let's say they have three lands, meaning that they can play. There's the world leader's call. Meaning that they can play two instants or sorceries. They will pump the slick shot shove and the cold break here. At this stage I don't want to risk it. I'm going to block with all my creatures all the creatures that I can block. The show off I cannot block it because I don't have flank. The show off I cannot block it. What they are going to do? What? There is a frenzy. Okay. The first pump. There's a frenzy, the first pump. So my knight is gone. There's a range. Okay. There's a range. All my creatures are all dead. <laughs> all my creatures are dead. I really risk that game. I really risk that game. But they don't have any more red mana. I just go recruiter. Recruiter will pump. And I just go for the victory. 5 damage, 12 0. <laughs> That's how you win with a Boros Convoke deck. I hope you liked these arena games. Subscribe to my channel for more and more interesting videos about Magic the Gathering and the collectible world.